Hi, it's Leah Craftsman Direct, and I don't know if you can see behind me. Can you see? There you can. We're in Eric's kitchen this morning, and we got a goof. And um, there it is. You can see the corner here of a piece of drywall intersecting. It's been a little drop down. Screws are actually visible, and um, it looks like this is a second round. And by that, what I mean is that there's been popcorn spray here. It doesn't match the existing. You can see a clear line here. And that's why I was talking about that other repair over there. We use a feathering method. So, um, again, we tent this area that will go to the wall out probably a foot. Come out to, and we have to take your light down. And we will go past the receptacle a little bit and then come back in and you're picking up light so you can't see but um let's remove and i'm gonna call that two foot wide and probably four feet long so we can't get a two by two chunk we got to get a four by eight chunk and cut a little bit off one of the problems here inherent to this repair is you see that's drywall color that's not primer color so when you start feathering this stuff drywall is not going to stick well on top of drywall that's already been sprayed it'll fall so um, we can't feather much and I don't know if we can feather at all sometimes it, it fails to accept anything on top of it and when you put wet kernels on it it doesn't like it and it drinks and it falls that's why you prime sealant but this, build, this builder didn't prime the sealant so we will um, put a new panel in tape three coats try five minute mud um, prime and um, let's get a coat of popcorn up here and uh, try to get it to match as well as we can. Thank you. Let me get a further away shot before I leave you. Um, notice he's got the hardwood floor and there's no far away. And you see us, that, that's at two foot by four foot. Thanks.